D.C. Now, Mitchell Elementary School students go back to class tomorrow. They've been out of school since fire destroyed part of their building last week. Teachers and staff prepared rooms in a different school. Lacey Crisp is live with that story. Lacey? Well, parents and students are already starting to trickle in to get a tour of their new classrooms here at Winpoint. Now their new school for at least the rest of this school year. Teachers spent the day making sure everything was ready for the first day of class tomorrow. It's been an emotional few days, um, a lot of really high highs, a lot of low lows. Less than a week after a fire ripped through part of Mitchell Elementary Middle School. Teachers and students will head back to class now at Win Point. So do you feel like the last two days, yesterday, today, is kind of a sprint to get a blank canvas ready for the kids for tomorrow? Yeah, blank canvas is a great way to describe it. Um, and it has, it's been busy. It's definitely been a sprint. Teachers called on their family members to help with the final touches on bulletin boards and other decorations to make the new classrooms feel like home. The more it can start to feel like home and um, that's really what we want this to be at the end of the day. Fourth grade dual language teacher Carmen Janecki explains it wouldn't be possible without all the donations, volunteers and help. That has been a little bit re-energizing I think because you know seeing the way that the community responded it just gives us that little bit of a push to to get in here. And we sat down with the fire chief this afternoon. Coming up tonight at 6, what he says helped stop the fire and what he wishes could have helped fight the fire. Reporting live in Racine, Lacey Crisp, today's TMJ4. Okay, we'll see you then. Thank you, Lacey. Well, students go back to Mitchell Middle School on March 18th. A waiver from the state means they won't have to make up for lost days, but they will have to make up for the time by extending the day for another 40 minutes. That means school starts at 8.10 a.m. instead of 8.35 and ends at 8 at 3.50 instead of 3.35. June 17th will be the last day of school, just like the rest of the Racine schools.